You don't mind me asking, what's a pretty lady like you doing eating alone here on Christmas Eve? It's my flight home. Where's home at? Hey, Charlie. You know what I bet this lady wants for Christmas? Some peace and quiet. <sighs> me on the other hand. Thanks. And a lousy day. This will be the first time I haven't been home for Christmas and well, ever. Still smiling. That's something. So that's my excuse for drinking alone on Christmas. What's yours? Well, I'm not big on excuses. Besides, I'm not drinking alone now, am I? No, you're not. Now I just got one more question. Hmm. You gonna finish that steak? Damn right, I'm gonna finish it. Now go. <sighs> I want you to know I don't normally go home with guys I've met in bars. Oh, good. It makes two of us. <laughs> Wow, this is, um, sparse. Yeah, you know, I've only been here for about a year, year and a half, so. I can't be comfortable. Well, it's better than a standard issue cot. Military or prison? I did a couple tours in Iraq. Also spent a night in county. Back in high school, cow tipping laws are pretty strict around here. <laughs> That is a very, very small tree. Oh, uh, yeah, they, they, they gave those to us at work. Here. Brightens up the place. Yeah, it does. Hmm. The couch is comfy. It's a little rough around the edges, but... I see some potential. Yeah? Yeah. Such a bad Christmas. No. Not bad at all. Wives. Just accidents happen. Right? <clears throat> right now, Rick, Rick! Are you talking about my wife? There's a room full of people here. Answer me! Are you talking about my wife? Did I touch a nerve? Sorry, detective. Not like this, Riggs. Too many people looking. Come on. Let's turn them out of your cage. Hey, hey. 